Hey guys, welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved, where today we're going to go and do our first tower thing. And I don't know much about them, other than the fact I'm pretty sure you get artifacts from them. So I did some some shopping, basically, and I got I got the artifact pedestal. I got the beer barrel, just because I thought it would look cool in the house. Um, I got something else. I got the grappling hook, because I think that would actually... If I'm not wrong, I think that means you can basically swing swing betwe between things, and I think that would be sick. And then I got a Megalodon saddle, because why wouldn't I? And then the Fabricator, Polymer, and Electronics. So, bit of shopping done. But I also realised that I have... Where's it gone? This blueprint here. I'm not entirely sure how I use it. I, I think maybe what I do is put it in here. And then... I need one more crystal, so who has my crystals again, is it? It's someone. Also, yeah, I've kind of worked out what is causing the lag. I'm pretty sure it's my dinosaurs, because, I mean, I'm on 42 frames there, and as soon as I turn back around this way, I jump straight back up to 65. Like, st instantly back up, so I'm trying to, like, not look at them. Who has my crystals? You've got some crystals, they'll do. So, yeah, like, I'm, I'm gonna have to, like, spread them out a little bit, I think, just to stop the lag actually happening. But it's alright, because we're not even going that way today. We're literally... Ah, yes, that is how you do it. Oh, but I only get one. That's... Oh, wait, no, hang on. It would help if I actually crafted it. Oh, no, I don't only get one. That's good. But I'm assuming this holds a lot more water than a um than a water skin, which is going to be good, because I always run... Like, a water skin is literally a one-time use, basically. So let's fill this up. Wait, I, say it's... I say it's only a one-time use. This is only, like, a two-time use by the looks of things. It'd be very nice if it filled up. There we go. Do I have enough food? I've got food. I also did all get a grappling hook, as you can pretty much already see. I've got, I didn't have enough time to get um enough iron to make a long neck rifle, I'll admit. But it shouldn't matter that much because I've been giving it some thought. And if I unlocked the pedestal at level 25, that presumably means I could have taken them around level 25. So I should I should be easily able to. Now, I'm going to bring Spino and Baryonyx, mainly because I think it's easier to get there through the water. So I'm going to go on my raft, and Karno... I think Karno's an alright swimmer, but he... I don't know how, like, alright he is. I suppose, actually, I can test him out a little bit. Give me some more damage, why not? Um, whistle follow. Lag, it's lagging. Let's look away from them. Whistle follow. Right, that's... Do you know what? I'll, tr I'll try corner out. Let's see. And whistle follow. Right, so that's good. Like, these two... It, Spino by herself would be able, the, easily able to do the job, I think. But just to be absolutely sure, we're going to bring all of them. Spino? Oh, there you are. Right, let's go. What just happened? Oh, here we go. Right, we're off. I mean, also Spino should easily be able to take any Megalodons that attack. So... We should be fine there. But yeah, this could actually take a while, given that it's actually quite slow on the... Yeah, Karno Con can probably keep up with me on the raft. I mean, it can't keep up with Spino or Baryonyx, but I, I'm i not very fast on the raft, so it's it should be fine. Oh, sick. A waterfall. That's pretty cool. And yeah, as you can probably tell, I did decide to run here instead of swim, because I, I, I just wanted to bring Karno. Oh, there's a raptor there, but I mean, if that raptor attacks me, it's pretty pretty stupid, let's just be honest. Also, I wonder what animals are around this area. I mean, there's a Sarko over there. Um, I, won I, I wonder what is around here. I wonder if there's anything, like, different. I might actually do that. I might explore a little bit before I, um... I mean, sorry, before, after I've... I, I was going to say after I've done this. After I've hopefully done this, I might explore, like, these bottom islands. See what's about. See if there's anything cool. But I think, yeah, I'm just about under it. So, oh, it's a, there's, a, there's, there's, a, unless that, I don't actually know what it's called, but unless it's level 200, oh, Spino, what are you doing down there? How are you now going to help me out? Right, um, I suppose I could just jump in the water and then it would follow me in, wouldn't it? I was saying that, Spino can probably get up around here somewhere. How do I get down though? That's a question. Maybe I have to actually, I have to go through the water, don't I? At least it looks like it. Do you, do you take fall damage when you hit the water? 
I'm very, very tempted to find that out, but I'm also not tempted to find that out. So let's just run around. Spino will be fine down there by himself. But yeah, I wonder if... I, 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 so I suppose each... Each, like, um... Otterterodon. Uh, each... Uh, what are these called? Artifact Towers. I suppose each one of them has, like, a kind of like a boss. They each have, like, sort of a boss dinosaur there. So, this one is presumably one of the easier ones, given that... I mean, by myself, I probably couldn't take it. But with... Well... If Spino decides to get out of the water, that is. With Spino and Carno and Baryonyx, I should easily be able to take this. Where is Spino? What is it? There we go. Oh, you're an idiot. Honestly, I don't need you, Spino. If this, as long as this is a low level. If it's, if it's too high a level, I'll just jump in the water to Spino. Oh, wait. I should have brought my spyglass, because that way I could have seen what level it was. Although saying that, I probably could try and lure it out anyway. Now nah, let's just go for it. It can't be too high level. I'm honestly, I'm expecting level twenty something. But even still, I should be able to kill it. Let's switch to this just for like first hit. Here we go. I wonder what level it is. I'm not expecting too much. I'll admit, I'm I'm really not expecting too much. What level is Level 3. <laughs> I feel sorry for you. I feel... Oh, now it's in the water with Spino. Oh, no, it's not. It's there. Hang on a minute. Carno, don't die. Um, Spino, do you want to do any damage? To Why are they not attacking it? There, kill. Kill it. Kill it. Well, Baryonyx was the only one that actually attacked it there. I mean, it was yeah, it was literally level 3. I might go and try and do another one then. So, here we go. What's this? So, I assume this is the artifact. Access inventory. Red obelisk terminal. Ooh. Min survivor level... Oh, minimum survivor level level 55. Use this, use this to generate a portal to the dragon. Okay. I mean, can I... Oh, wait. I can't take it. So, wait. I thought you could get artifacts from these. I'm very confused. Um, wait, so artif crafting requirements. Artifact of the cunning, artifact of the immune, artifact of the Skylord, artifact of the strong. So where do I get the artifacts then? Allosaurus brain. Lovely. Um, Tyrannosaurus arm. So, th so they're like boss kills, sort of. Giga heart. I need two giga hearts. That means I need... It's, that's, that's difficult. Where do I get the artifacts then? Unless I don't get artifacts from this one. I mean, honestly, though, yeah, I'll, I'll just go and try and do another one then. Because that was really easy. Okay, then, we finally got to this um, obelisk thing, which is so much further away than I thought it was. Honestly, I probably should have went to that one. Because I think that's the mountain I went to last episode, isn't it? I mean, saying that, I didn't really see anything new here. This, this was basically just through the swamp. Like, the swamp ends literally just past that, like, mountain thing. That's, it's... There wasn't much new, so let's go and see what's in here. Okay, what dinosaur is it? Okay, there isn't one. Right, well, this makes this far easier. Are you sure there's no dinosaur? There's a raptor there, but, I mean, a raptor isn't going to do much to me. There really isn't a dinosaur here. Wow. Okay, then, let's just go. Hopefully, I actually do get artifacts from this, because... Ow. Because if I don't get artifacts from here, where do I get them from? Like, really, where do I get artifacts from if it's not from these? Because I, I honestly thought this was fully where I get artifacts from. Maybe it's the... Yeah, you're dead, Raptor. <laughs> Maybe it's the, um... The artifacts you get are from actual, like... Actually, like, killing dinosaurs, and it gives you them, like, trophy things. Maybe it's they're the artifacts. But I'm pretty sure they're not, because actually... No, because on that last one, it did say you get artifacts, didn't it? So where do you get them from? Maybe you get them from like, I don't know, dungeons or something. Two thousand years later. Yeah. So we finally found the cave, and basically caves are the things that have the uh, artifacts in them. Wow, it's quite laggy in this cave. That's really not good. Also, the cave is basically it's pretty good because it's close to my house. It's literally like, I think it's about fifty-five longitude and like eighty-five latitude. 
So it's actually pretty close to my house, which is nice. What are these things here? I wonder if I can mine them. Oh, I can. It's crystal. That's pretty cool. Okay, so I'm guessing at some point there's going to be a big room with a thing in. Wait, what? What is this? Oh my god, what is that? <laughs> there's literally a thing there. Look, there's a thing. Look, there's a thing there. Um, What is happening to the wall over there? Is that some sort of like illusion? Oh, God, I don't, I don't know. What do I do? Do I fight it? Um, I wish I had my spyglass and I could tell what level it is. All right, okay, we're gonna go for it. This could be a mistake, but oh, you've got to be joking! I've contracted what? Oh, it was a Megalania. Oh, right. That's it's basically a giant Komodo dragon. Primitive bow. Megalania toxin. Will this toxin thing kill me by any chance? I'm rather hoping the answer is no. But what is going... I mean, six, 60 seconds of something happening to me basically is what it is. Yeah, but I'm, I'm almost guaranteeing that Megalania would have attacked me. Oh my... Nope. Why did my crossbow have to break? Is all I'm going to say. Oh no. <laughs> Run! <laughs> I literally just turned around the corner. There's about 17 snakes and 23 spiders. Chop away. Just chop away. Let's go. Let's... Go. Yeah, that's not went well. I didn't expect there to be that many snakes and spiders there, to be quite honest with you. Oh, this is looking... I think this is it. Please, artifact. Right, please nothing jump out and kill me when I take this artifact. It weighs five. What's my weight? I mean, I'm, I need to drop some stuff, actually. Um. Oh, yeah, I forgot I had this because I made another one, didn't I? So I'll drop that. I'll honestly drop the water skins. I don't need them. Um. I'll drop... I'll drop these berries. Right, that should be enough. Artifact numero uno. Artifact of the hunter. Sick. Right, do you know what? Um, oh, wow, it's very dark on the screen now, but um, I'll try and find some more light. Here we go. Right, so basically, I'm just going to end the episode now because it's honestly taken me so long to do this. So, so long. I'll just, I'll just make an artifact pedestal off camera and put it on then. And then I'll show you, like, the start of the next episode. Um, but yeah, I will see you next time.